Do talk to him. Welcome Hi. back. <laughs> Welcome to the rally. Be productive. Hey, oh, you remembered it. <laughs> Be productive. <laughs> remember. And it's a Monday. Dave, Dave he's, he's picking his game up. He must have watched your video and thought, oh, I better pick my game up. And it's a Monday. <laughs> and, and you remembered. Yeah. How good is that? So, uh, there we go, everyone. Uh, thank you very, very much for all your feedback about me uh, trip away. Me and uh, Jane there had a lovely time in Leicester with uh, Alistair and Dawn and um, Julie and Charles and, uh, and Mark and Becky and uh, James and... Uh, Liberty. Huh? Liberty. And Libby. Libby, thanks for the sat-nav, <laughs> for the postcode. She's convinced she gave me the right postcode. I'm not convinced. I told Libby, my opinion was the same as hers. We'd both be wrong. Took her a while to work that one out. <laughs> but there we go. We're cracking on. And this at the moment, just giving it a really good flat and it's going to have another coat of primer. It's the hay cratch for the wagon over there. We're sort of killing two birds with one stone. Nick's been actively employed making the sides for the steps. Yep. Making an extra set while we're here. Not making any more steps, just so you know, before you ask, it isn't happening, we're busy. But if you have a look here at uh, John O'Neill's wheels, They've had sanding right the way back, all the paint taken off right the way back to wood. They've had a good old sanding. They've then had a first coat of primer. And uh, if you come and have a look here, the, this one has had its second coat of primer as well. That one's had its second coat. So, it, you know, they're, for 110 years old, yeah, that's what we worked it out today. 110 years old. They're, they're looking good again, aren't they? Um, you know, you can see it spinning away there nicely. What a fantastic piece of engineering. That's all there is to it, you know. Well balanced. Still very usable. A very usable 110-year-old uh, antique, isn't it? So, uh, there you go, John. You'll be pleased to see that. They're uh, ready for the uh, gloss. So we'll get them glossed up tomorrow once this has gone hard. Uh, and I think that's it. Is that it? Is that what? Uh, yawn. Yeah, yawn. Okay. Yawn is Welsh for okay. <laughs> uh, then we're done. We're going to make the top steps and all the steps to go up and the oblong box to clamp it all together and everything. So they should be together today or somewhere near. But well, certainly by the end of tomorrow, we should have two sets of steps there ready to be done. Once again, it'll be the usual thing, burn all the knots, treat them with knotting. You had to put some scallops into them. Yeah, Your yeah. Your favourite job. Favourite job. Yeah. yeah. Not his favourite job at all. <laughs> but generally on the whole, things are looking good. As you can see, he's hard at work. As usual. Put his bed over there for him this morning, and that's where he's been ever since. It's all right for some minutes, it's a dog life. An absolute dog's life, isn't it? So there we go. I'm going to give another shout out, and it's once again to Thomas Clark. We are thinking of you, Thomas. You get well soon, my friend. Uh, and John O'Neill, um, give us a give us a bell when you get a chance as well. Anybody you want to give a shout out to, Nick? Uh, I liked my daughter's going on holiday, isn't it? I've oh, a good yeah. holiday. Oh yeah. Poppy. Yeah. She's going yeah. on holiday, is she? Yeah. Anywhere nice? Uh, abroad. <laughs> abroad. He doesn't know. So there we go, Poppy, have a lovely holiday. Abroad. Hope you yeah. do. Uh, I'm going to give uh, Sean Edmai, my own granddaughter, who is uh, away in the Caribbean at the moment, sunning herself. Still? So, all right, yeah, still, yeah. yeah. All right for some, isn't it? God bless everybody. Have a great day. Dioch. Dioch. Thank you. Bye-bye, <laughs> everyone.